You ready to go, Macy? Because yeah. we're at Disney. You ready, Macy? We're going on an adventure. Woo! Good morning from Value Resort. <laughs> It's, no, I don't want a hairbrush. She doesn't want her hair brushed. Let it be dreadlocks. Macy will have dreadlocks before the 250th episode of this. Anyway, the bathroom. Thumbs down, Wyndham. We are definitely in a value resort. But the rooms are alright. And uh, we're getting ready to head out. And here's the view from Value Resort 1. You got downtown Disney. You've got right there is hollywood house tower of terror hollywood house which macy rode last night macy how was tower of terror how was it tell your brother she did well she did well epcot off in the distance the rain's just clearing through and we should have a pretty decent day Day one lightning lane, mom. What do you think? Day one. I'm just, you know what? I don't want to be negative every day, so I'm just going to keep my opinion to myself till the last day. We only had to wait in one line. It was Slinky Dog. It was about half it an really hour. It really wasn't bad. And it wasn't bad. So we can wait in some queues today if we have to. First ride is the Barnstormer at 10, I think. 10.30. 10.30. So we have to go. We're going to go off property for breakfast, probably at Denny's or a Waffle House. Hibachi, hibachi breakfast. And uh, yeah, man. Let's get this day underway. Super kitties. Remix. Remix. Happily ever after. felt like everyone was annoyed at the ticket booth with us singing. So the, the check, I, I saw her say something and I think she said like, oh, they can't hear over here. I'm like, what do you need to hear? Give them you, your money. Yeah, Hand sorry. I'm jamming happily ever hey, after. Hey, you're at a kid's party. <laughs> Did they really told me that they couldn't hear? Okay, that's fine. I was playing a Disney song and I'm going to do it every single time we come, whether Sawyer likes it or not, whether the front gate ticket people like it or not. Because I like it. You want to save the battery. And my family okay. likes it. Okay, take a seat. Some of them. Dude, as if lightning lane stuff wasn't bad enough. I mean, it just took us 20 to get through security. It is packed. Tuesday, August 7th, maybe? August 6th? What? It's packed. We're going to go take the monorail. But this looks like a foolish choice. Ferry boat? Ferry boat. Ferry boat. Ferry boat. Ferry boat. Ferry boat. <laughs> Ferry boat. Good call. Yeah, no, nah, ferry boat. We'll do the monorail on the way back. We'll do the monorail when there's not a thousand people trying to do the monorail. Holy cow. Yeah, that is. That's what do you think? <laughs> You're. I think we don't light these passes on fire after today with this new lightning lane BS. I know it's a busy day here. You know how? Because it's a hot day. Because it's a hot day? Because they got the water on. The water's never on. They got the water on today. Mom, they got the water on. That's what I got. 
What do you got? We sold those passes to a homeless family. Let me see your boo-boo. What happened? Take us through it. Well, I was like, Macy hugged me, and then she that, hugged me, and then we just both fell. The hug turned rough? Uh-huh. And you got a little blood? And I was trying to grab on the pole, but I couldn't, and then we just fell. Heck I didn't yeah. cry, though. No crying. Oh, by the way, if you get blood on you, subscribe. <laughs> Oh, I'm not spinning it. I don't want to spin it. All right, go get the cart, bubs. All right, we got teacups. We're keeping it regional. A Denny's breakfast is sitting in my throat. Where are you guys going? All right, big, big top souvenirs it is. What is going to be the first snack of the day? First snack of the day. Macy Bell, first snack of the day. What's it gonna be? Snack of the day. It's the first, first snack of the day. It smells so good in here, doesn't it? I'm always ready. Are you ready? Mom, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you on your phone? You can see the frustration of lightning laying on your mother's face as she's yelling. Sir! Sawyer! You guys go fast! Are you going fast? Are you going fast? Here we go! Spin it! Other way, this way. Whoa! Spin it! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Spin it! Uh Oh, spin it! Spin it! This way. All right, the other way. Ready? <laughs> spin it! I want to do it, Dad. All right, go. Open your eyes, Angela. Get her, Sawyer, get her. Get her, Sawyer, get her. Oh! Good job. <laughs> All right, mom had her. Mom had her the whole time. She was waiting at the end for us. Okay, we have nothing to do. We have no idea what to do now with Lightning Lane, so we're gonna have to figure something out. Might go stand in a line, I guess. Stand in a line? Oh. Scan his ticket. Scan he in. He doesn't know how this works. Who? Oh. Seven Dwarves is at 70 minutes. And I, it, I mean, it feels like it's the week of Christmas. It feels like tomorrow is uh, Christmas Eve here at Disney. Look at this. All the food kiosks are open. Brats and Tots has every window open. That's pretty rare. But anyway, we're making our way to Big Thunder Mountain, which is all we got. Might stand in line for pirates, might come back. And then we're gonna do some lunch. Gotta figure that out. Carousel line, all the way back queue, look at that. We haven't seen that back queue used in months. I don't know who's saying it's dead at Disney. It might've been dead last week. Disney is post hurricane thick right now. Peter Pan's down, Tiana's is down right now. Fix your, fix your rides, Disney. Fix your rides. Listen, I wanna take this time to express how freaking lucky that we are that we never ever have to go to Disney when it's like this. We cruise over here on Sunday nights and never ever have to deal with this. This is, this is Disney, this is Disney Disney. This is Disney Disney. This is like old school, pre-COVID, everybody gotta wait Disney Disney. We got some lighting lanes. Let's, let's go. Let's go poop this up. Poop it up. Glasses. 
Macy. Cause this here's a what? Sawyer, what do you got? You got a splinter, huh? In his back. A bad one too. Pretty nasty. So we're gonna go ride this ride while Sawyer has a splinter in his back. And we got the caboose. So it's a big seat and it's gonna get whippy. I love it. Woo! Yeah. You all right? I know it hurts. You're so tough, though. Hey, big T. Raising savages. Raising savages up in here. Yeah, whip. <laughs> you only get weightless in the back, huh? <laughs> These are hot springs, baby. Yeah. No, that's a stalactite stalagmiteness. I'm no scientier, but I play one on televiso. Okay, buddy. All right, let me show. What do we got? What's the diagnosis? It's just. Oh, uh, we got a splinter sticking out of skin. Sawyer, how's it feel? Dude, we got a splinter and a bloody elbow. And a bloody elbow. You're giving it up for Disney today. Holy cow. All right, you ready? Okay. Yeah. Can you tell me when you're ready? Dad's not doing it. Mommy's I'm in a video. But mom, you need this straw also. Whoa, mom. Coming in MacGyver style. Yeah, hold on. You're fine. Uh, Here, I need you to, yep, lean. Hold on, hold on. Let her go. Here we Just go. Just lean over, buddy. You got this. All right. You ready? You got this. Mom is so smart. Okay, sorry. Don't move. She's got it. She's so smart. Oh, she got it. All right, well, after a bunch of failed attempts, even though the mommy did the genius thing, oh, that way. And uh, she tried to use a straw to get the splinter out. We gotta go do this first, and then we'll dole whip it up. How you feeling, bud? Spirits are low, but we're gonna go do some man shit. Go to the EMS trailer. Here we go. All right, Big G, how was that? It was good, we got it out. Got it out? Man stuff, you did good? Yeah, man. It wasn't the backstage uh, tour we wanted. It was the backstage tour we got here at First Aid. And Sawyer got a splinter ripped out of him. And I couldn't film in there because of, you know, OSHA? No, not OSHA, the other one, the secrecy one. Yeah, you had to lay on your side. He did so good. He wants chicken fingers. And he shall get chicken fingers if they have them or just tell us where they are. I don't need chicken fingers. I'm good with Dole Whip. Mom, he was such a big dog in there. Good. He was God. awesome. He was a big dog. God. He wasn't yelling and screaming and punching her. He got it out with you. That's good. And then he went Big G. I just yeah, had to talk so him up. I'm happy for her. I'm very happy for her. <laughs> this is the best time of my life. All right. Sometimes, you know, as a Disney family, 
you do spend a ton of time here. You do realizations from other people around you. And we just saw a mom yep. sending off her probably 10 and 12 year old and giving them a time to meet them back, which means they're gonna separate from their family at the park and then meet again. That just got me feeling so sad. Literally just got me so sad thinking about when my kids are like, hey, we're gonna go off on our own. We'll meet you in two hours somewhere in Disney. And then I'm gonna be alone. Ugh. Getting old is not a good time. It's not a good time. Disney realizations, dab tip of the day number two. Spend all the time you can with your little kids, man. Woof, rough. Oh, and this one's for Grandpa Novak. The Enchanted Tiki Room. This is Grandpa Novak's favorite. Time and time again, it's a nice, dark, cold ride. Next to Dole Whips. Is Macy not coming? Where are they at? Oh, there she's back in the stroller. Oh, these kids. Come over here. Come over here. These kids. They are something today. Yikes. Ah, the enchanted tiki room. I almost fell out of my number patch. <laughs> Glad to see you all aboard. Uh, uh, sure. Or <laughs> all right. These are post Tiki Bird Show Tiki Room Dole Whips. Macy is all about the pineapple cake now. Yeah, go ahead. Sawyer got the swirl. Mommy got the float. And Daddy got the serenade. Welcome. What's going on? Um, nothing. It took us about two hours to get here. Oh, two hours, nice. Nice, bro. Bro, it takes long. It takes long enough getting to my grandmother's house, which is only an an hour and a half away, but in Coral Spring. Oh. That's all right. You just had one job. I swear, I you forgot it at the house. Right by the front. You forgot it at the house. You had one job. You literally had one job. He was going to. He was going to bring me the screw for the GoPro. And he, one job is to keep my children alive. That's April's job. That's April's job. I was trying to take credit for it. <laughs> That's all right. I'll just keep. What, here's what I have to do. I want to show you the whole circuit of what I've been doing here. I shoot something. I say something moderately funny. <laughs> Thing. Something about SeaWorld is it's kind of just in the bowels of hell. I feel like it's always deadly there. We were just there for his fucking field trip and it was like just terrible. Yeah. Then you made it to like 10 after 1 and that was it. <laughs> what time did you get there? 10? Yeah. They don't open until like 10, right? VIP, VIP, VIP. You want to jump on? Who are these people? Who are these people? How are they for ten thousand dollars? Who are they? Hmm? Hmm? Who's the VIP? Who's the VIP? Ten G's. Yeah, and ten G's, and then it's a thousand over every person. Crazy. Oh, this wind is magic. Ninety-two degrees in the sun. Maybe ninety-four today on the pavement. But this wind is making it bearable. All right, that was 20 minutes. 20 minutes? What was it? Maybe 12. How long was that? I'm not even sweating anymore. I'm sweating. I'm I had a daughter on I'm my shoulder. How long was it? I said 12 minutes. All right, 12 minutes then. 12 minutes of waiting. Now we get to go on the people mover. Blah, 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 blah. We're the reason. Sorry, John. Have fun, John. I knew if I was the first. I knew if I was the first one in the car, I wouldn't be able to be the first one out of the car. So anyway, I set that up. Enjoy your journey. Enjoy your journey. Sorry for slowing down your journey. Sorry, everybody. Sorry, fellas.
I thought for sure. I was like, wow, really? They're gonna let us let this happen? Wait, we'll just talk to them the next time so we ask them. 13. You mean this stuff right here? Press on. You need to make a YouTube short about this. All right, I'm doing it. Oh, back on. That was a short one. Short lived. That would have been a great evacuation. All right, fill it back up again. We broke it on the way in. Somebody else broke it on our ride. So, all's fair in moving people through the universe. All right, well, after getting broke down, after breaking down the people mover and then getting broke down, I think we're riding Carousel of Progress yeah. for the third time in three trips. This is our this is our new uh, this is our new. I, I, I'm flabbergasted, but the Okins have never been on it, so we're gonna take them on uh, the sleepy ride from the uh, you know the thing. We're gonna take them on the air conditioned ride. The air conditioned ride with the nice seats. 20 minutes, air ride. Twenty minutes of air conditioning. So if you gotta pee, pee now. Beautiful tomorrow, shining at the end of every day. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow to bust a dream away. <laughs> you don't want to come on Tron? He can't come on Tron because you, you you would have to steal a lightning light. Do you, do you care if I ride Tron without you? Angela, do I care if you, if you ride Tron without me? Uh huh. No, I don't. Oh, All right. All right. Your name is Angela. Yeah, it's it. I identify as a woman. This is my wife, oh, Angela. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't want that. All right. You ready? All right. Carousel of progress. All right. Preston, you'll be with us. Funny band. Funny band. All right. Let's go. Let's go herc and jerk our way on here. Let's go. Really awesome roller coaster. But first time, that was a uh, what? Time, first row? Come on, you don't beat that. 10 out of 10? Can't beat it. Uh, 10 out of 10. I'll give it 10 out of 10. It's a pretty good one. It, dude, to blast you out at 70 miles an hour like that? Awesome. <laughs> Our plan now is to go out to hit the pool for a little bit and then meet back up with the Oakins at Downtown Disney tonight for dinner. We got no reservations. We got to figure that out. Especially when all these people are here. They may not be running the drone show because of the wind again, too. So we might miss out on that. Uh, struggles, bro. Lightning lane is not that bad. I'm not that mad at it. We got to do a bunch of stuff today. We'll see. Going forward. Touch me again. You got cheese touched. I don't know. You got, you got, know, you got you cheese touched cheese. by the Lord. This kid's been. Into chaos. Macy's crying, Sawyer's cutting across traffic. And in the it's Disney time, isn't it lovely? Angela, smile by the castle for a thumbnail. I was gonna wear these shorts tomorrow. I love it, perfect. It's a little. I've said it before and I'll say it again, this weather makes it feel like fall. When the sun goes behind the clouds, it feels like a fall day. Like football's about to kick off, like the leaves are about to change. We've got pumpkins on Main Street. They still haven't got the Halloween decorations through here, but they are down Main Street and in the front. So they have started all the Halloween decor. See all the happy people taking pictures with the castle. This is it, man. People spend a lot of money to spend a day here. And we get to do it all the time. All the time. Blessed, man, blessed. Throw gas. Smell that ice cream. That's Grandpa's spot right there. What? I didn't know anything about Dole Whips when I was a kid because my dad was a Main Street ice cream parlor guy. My kids don't know anything about a Main Street ice cream parlor because you're a Dole Whip. Because their dad's a Dole Whip guy. Ain't that funny how the universe works? Oh. Right up from your environment. They give people rides.
All right, here we go. Pumpkins. This is the last time we'll see pumpkins. How long, Mom, do you think before we come back? Two million. Uh, let's see. You'll want to come back before the kids go back to school. What? Four days. No, I won't. Anyway, here's the pumpkins. It's awesome. My wife doesn't like coming to Disney with me. I love it. She loves it. <laughs> that is making the vlog. <laughs> Little moments in time. Listen, we are at the very tail end of summer. We are. We're going back to school on Monday. We have We're been. All the guy asked me, I told him not about the Tron hookup. And he goes, How many times do you read the Tron? I said, I think it's 25. <laughs> Wild card. Got to keep an eye on me. But uh, I forgot our daughter I, was under the stroller. But I do that thing, you know? Hi. Love you. All right, well, my idea was downtown Disney for dinner, but apparently we can't do downtown Disney with a party of eight. Nothing's available till when? Nine? Well, you have to plan everything out. We don't plan stuff. Yeah, let me just shoot this little vid and then you get on my shoulders. So, anyway, we're going to go to the pool and then we're going to go to Ford's Garage maybe again. Okay, I got you. I got to put her on my shoulders. I'll talk to you in a bit. Oh, perfect. Tell them what happened. Injury number four of the day. What happened? Well, I was playing ball. I, my dad's telling me I decided to be cute. And then, literally, I stepped, what is it called? I stepped on oh. like this vent or something that is so sharp. In the pool? In the pool. And cut his feet all up. Twice. Now both of the bottoms of his feet are all sliced up. I'll show you until we get back to the room. Perfect. You also have to do, have to, you have to lick your socks until you press that button. I know, I said that. 